Hey guys! So December is almost over and before it actually finishes I wanted to talk a bit about my favorite themes from this month. So we will once again start with more media stuff, movies I've only... Oh, I've gone to a few different movies and they were all fantastic. I saw the new Star Wars twice. It was so good. I was very, very happy with it. And I also saw The Shape of Water and it was amazing. If you haven't gone out and seen either of those movies, I highly recommend them. I really, really like The Shape of Water. It was such a beautiful story and a beautifully done film. So I highly recommend it. TV shows, a whole lot on the TV show front. Bob's Burgers had a Christmas special that was twice as long as their normal episodes and it was amazing. I also, for the the first time, kind of the first time, I finally watched the TV show Younger. I've seen previews of it. I think I see, saw one to two episodes sometime before and I finally decided to actually go through and start sitting down and watching it and I actually really like it. It's kind of a dorky show about a 40 year old who lies about her age and pretends to be 26 to get back into working in publishing but it's really really funny and uh, a lot of the characters are kind of fun and Hilary Duff is in it. You can check that out on Hulu if you're into shows like that. I also got some Christmas albums on vinyl and I got A Very She and Him Christmas, which if you read my blog post on my recommended Christmas music, is one of my favorite Christmas albums. So I was really excited to get it on vinyl and it was really nice to have during my Christmas party. Books, I've pretty much just been reading Harry Potter, still. It's so good. But I did pick up and uh, start perusing a few new books. This one is How to Be Parisian Wherever You Are, Love Style and Bad Habits. It is very, very funny so far. I haven't finished it yet. And I've also been slowly going through How to Hage, Hage, Hage. The Nordic Secrets to a Happy Life. This one also has recipes in it. Uh, it is not my first book on the subject, but this one has definitely a whole lot more of the recipes than the last book that I read. And they look delicious. So those are two books. I have a whole bunch of books all stacked up and ready to start reading in January, which is when I kick off, I am this year trying to do the 50 book challenge and read 50 books all in the year 2018. Other things that I loved, I got this hair towel. It is amazing. It dries super fast. Where's, yeah, it's by Aquas. You can get it at Anthropology. I got this as an add-on through my Fab Fit Fun box and it has changed my life. My hair is so much more manageable. So I've used it to replace my hair dryer most times. So I like to deep condition and wash my hair at night and then wrap it up in the towel and sleep in it. And in the morning, my hair is ready to be styled and it's just shinier and smoother and so much easy to manage and it Oh, it has changed my life. It has made my life so much easier. So love, love, love this. I also invested in a new toothbrush. Now, one of my last videos was Zero Ways Mouth Care, and I had my bamboo toothbrush, and that is now going to be my travel toothbrush. I do still like it. It's cute, but I missed using an electric toothbrush because it was... It just makes my mouth feel a little bit cleaner than the bamboo or the regular one. They just It just is a really good job. So for Christmas this year, I bought myself a really nice Oral-B toothbrush with a bunch of different settings and it's got this little sensor. Did that go red? To show me when I'm brushing too hard because sometimes I brush too hard and my bamboo toothbrush doesn't tell me when I do that. I love it though makes all the difference in the world. And finally, on the beauty front, 
I got the Glossier Moisturizing Moon Mask. This winter has been very harsh on my skin. It's been feeling very, very dry, and this just makes it feel so much better. I really, really like it. I use it about once a week to help fight dry skin. And that's it. That's all the things I love from December, and I am excited to find a whole raft of new things that I love in 2018. If there's anything that you really liked from December, go ahead and leave it in the comment section. If you like this video, please give it a thumbs up. And don't forget to hit the subscribe button. I post a new video once to twice every single week. Bye!